So what is the big picture with virtualization? In either of the two approaches that I mentioned, whether it is full virtualization or para-virtualization, we have to virtualize the hardware resources and make them available safely to the operating systems that are running on top of the hypervisor. And when we talk about hardware resources, we're talking about the memory hierarchy, the CPU, and the devices that are there in the hardware platform, how to virtualize them and make them available in a transparent manner for use by the operating systems that live above the hypervisor. And how do we affect data and control transfer between the guest operating systems and the hypervisor? So these are all the questions that we will be digging deeper into in this course module. That wraps up the basic introduction to virtualization technology. And now it is time to roll up our sleeves and look deeper into the nuts and bolts of virtualizing the different hardware elements in the hypervisor.